So a breaking news everyday news on Prince Amila in the Timmy TV today is the um, 2nd of uh, September at 2022 remember guys to like share comment and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload here and so guys here's the latest latest news regarding to uh, wa former vice president Pe Leke Zela Mboko and so I uh, Siko Mboko fought for son of the former vice president Peleke Zela Mboko is facing charges of raping a 12 year old girl and for escaping from police custody. Mboko, who is facing three counts of rape, was remanded in custody to September 15 by regional magistrate Mr. Mark Zira. Allegations are that sometime between July and August this year, Mpoko raped the girl three times in Hillside in Bulawayo. Mr. Cooper said a medical examination was conducted and the report will be produced in court as evidence. The court also heard that on Tuesday around 4.30 p.m. at ZRP Hillside Charge Office, Mpoko was arrested and brought to the charge office for a crime of rape by Assistant Inspector Admiral Luna. While in the charge office he was booked for detention under ZRP U side detention book reference number 284 stroke 22 and he had signed for his belongings for detention. The accused person requested to get his medication from his motor vehicle which was parked outside the police station. The accused person was escorted by Constable Chumuka to his motor vehicle. He however jumped into his vehicle and speed off to a known destination said Mr. Kope. Mboko was represented by Mr. Tabekulu, Dube of Ngube and Partners Legal Practitioners. On Wednesday morning, Mboko posted online through a video on Ezra Chisas Banda's Facebook page saying he was handing himself over to the police after running away. Good morning to everybody. My name is Siko Mboko, a praying man, a God-fearing man and a family man. Today, yesterday, actually, I was called to the U-side police station and a rape charge laid against me. No investigations were done, but that's too fine. Yesterday, I ran away from the police station because I felt that there was no fairness in my case. I felt that things were not done properly and I felt that there was a hand behind it that is not a government. And so, uh, that's the latest here. And so, he made the whole situation uh, worse by running away from the police station. I mean, you have to have your day in court. And so, I, I don't think he will get his bill. I don't think he will get his bill uh, until the trial. I think he's going to remain in custody until the trial date. That's the worst part of uh, running away from uh, from the police station. And so, uh, he deserves his day in court. And the prosecutor, we have to come. We have to come. We have to come. And uh, yes, the girl uh, is actually uh, his niece. And uh, yes, uh, she is 12 years of age. And uh, so, we're going to keep you in the loop here on uh, Prince Mel Entertainment TV on daily news, breaking news, everyday news. So, the man has been remanded uh, in custody until six, uh, September 15. And uh, so, we'll be back here with more information. This is uh, daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Mel Entertainment TV. Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow. Bless up.